dead meme. All right, we're here to play some stationers. Today, we're going to look at a more advanced airlock. I showed a crude version in probably yesterday's video. So what this one does, it will basically keep the warm air in and I'll keep the cold air out. So we'll just do a quick cycle so you can kind of see what I mean. I'm coming into the base. I don't want the cold air in. This vent turns on, pushes it out. Allows me to come in. It depressurizes in an ugly fashion. You can tinker with this if it really matters to you. But what really matters to us is when I cycle out, this air only in, in here is only marginally warmer, but when we warm it up and we pressurize it with the rest of the base, when you pass through here, I don't want the heat to get out. So this vent turns on, pushes the warm air from the base back in. There we go. So now that I've shown you what it does, I'm going to show you how it works and how you may want to set it up. So I've taken the programming out of this console. Uh, I would like to make um, a caveat, I guess you could call it. Uh, I'm going to assume that you're looking at an advanced tutorial because you have a general understanding of how the airlock works. Like uh, explaining how to make a door, fill it with glass, create a pass event, wire it, like that's... If you're looking for that, you're in the wrong place. This is an advanced airlock guide. So now that that's covered, let's move on. All right, the first step is label things. So we need to know what the exterior door is. So Atmo outdoor, Atmo indoor. We need to know which vent is the cold air vent. Which one is the warm air? We should probably label the sensor as well so that it is very easy to troubleshoot if something doesn't go quite right. So on the side of the console, let's put the disc in. The very first thing I typically do is set these to zero. I don't really care the uh, how much air rushes in, like we close doors and we put things away in containers, so we're not expecting things to roll around. So the first thing we should do though is find the sensor in this list, Atmo lock sensor. So this is the air lock sensor for atmospherics, that's where we are. There we go. Now the first thing I typically do is it's looking for the very, so it's looking for an exterior. We want to give it the, uh, I like to deal with doors or sensors First, so complete the um, so let, let's just do the example Atmo outdoor. It's the green text tells us it's searching for an exterior door. Atmo outdoor, that's the exterior door. Perfect. So covered. Now it went red. That means it's looking that its companion needs to be dealt with more than likely. So we're looking for an interior door. There's a green text telling us we need to find an interior Atmo door in. So this thing will tell you basically when you've what it's looking for it's very very simple so we're looking for an exterior vent to go outside so we'll just scroll through cold air so the cold air is the vent going to the exterior so there we go and warm air so the green text we're looking for air to be pushed back into the interior there we go so it went green and let's see if it works all right, so so far it looks good. The It's asking us to cycle to exterior and the interior door is open. So what we're hoping for when we click on this, this vent will turn on and push the theoretical warm air back into the base. Exactly, perfect. And the door should open. And a bunch of air gets in because we're on Europa. But what really matters now this air is colder than what's inside. What we're hoping for is when we click cycle to interior, this vent turns on and pushes the cold air back out so we don't shock the environment in here. So let's see what happens. Excellent. And so basically we get a, a slight vacuum. The warm and cold air never touch. And that's exactly what we're looking for. Now, again, if you don't like the air rushing in like that when you set up your disk, just give it a pressure value for at least coming in. As some people don't, um, they're just, bases are more sloppy than others, right? It's not a judgment thing. But hopefully that's helpful. That's a more advanced airlock setup. Like, it's not hard to do by any means. 
But uh, hopefully that's helpful, and we'll see you all again real soon. And, uh, of course, if you would uh, be so kind, a like, a sub, or a share, something like that would be wonderful.